Hey everyone, it's Ethan Ormus back again for another video today and welcome back to the channel guys. We're here again uh, for yet another CD unboxing and review. We're doing another uh, NAV album. Today's going to be the final NAV album uh, that I have for you guys. Of course, I mentioned a big NAV haul uh, a while ago. I mentioned it in my last NAV video as well, but I got the Good Intentions vinyl. Uh, I got the Perfect Timing, Reckless, and Bad Habits deluxe CDs. So... Here is the Bad Habits Deluxe CD, uh, which is pretty cool. I'm very happy to get my hands on this. I'm very excited, so uh, let's open it up. Let's see uh, what's in here. Uh, I'm very excited to open this one up. This was uh, definitely my favorite Nav, uh, NAV album at the time that it came out. Um, but uh, it's, it's definitely uh, fallen off that ranking since then. Uh, not that I think this album is bad. It's not bad by any means. Some of my favorite Nav songs are on this uh, project, but I listen to the deluxe way more than I listen to the original album. Nonetheless, I am uh, super happy about this because, again, some of my favorite songs from Nav are on this album. So there we go. It looks pretty nice. Of course, the uh, green deluxe, the, of course, original is like an orange-ish orange -ish red uh, so yeah, very cool. Of course, it's a br pretty big track list as well. So we've got uh, To My Grave, I'm Ready, Taking Chances, Tap featuring Meek Mill, uh, Tension, Price on My Head featuring The Weeknd, Rallo, Tussin featuring Young Thug, Snap, Hold Your Breath featuring Gunna, uh, While You Cry and Mama, Time Peace featuring Lil Durk, Dior Runners, Vicodin, Stuck With Me, Know Me, and then the Deluxe, we have Amazing featuring Future, Habits, Rack in My Sleep featuring 88 Glam, Go to Hell, 8 to 4, Never Know, OK featuring Lil Dirk, and Athletes. So, uh, of course, a pretty big track list, but of course it is a Deluxe. So, let's open it up. Let's see what it looks like on the inside. Oh, we've got the sticker on the top of it, same as the last one. Let me just get the sticker off first, and then we'll open it up. Um, I'm intrigued to see... If there's a small little poster in here or something, and some of the CDs I've opened come with like a little poster uh, in the front of it, which is pretty cool. So I'm you know, intrigued to see if this one will also have that. But uh, yeah, I, I I haven't listened to this album much recently, but uh, again, like I said at the time, this was definitely one of my favorite projects. Came out in I believe March of 2019. Um, uh, yeah, March of 2019. And my main playlist at the time was uh, a couple of Juice songs from Death Race for Love and then a couple of songs from this album. It was, uh, I had Empty, Robbery, Hear Me Calling, The Bee's Knees. Uh, like those were the four main ones at the time from Death Race for Love. And then off this album, I had Snap, uh, Amazing, and 8 to 4. Those are definitely some of my favorite songs. So yeah, let's open it up and let's see what it looks like inside. Ooh, ooh, that's very cool. I really like that CD. That's very, very sweet. Uh, over here it says, uh, Executive Produced by Nav Garaya, Nav, uh, Abel, The Weekend Tesfe, and Amir Cash, uh, Esmalion, I think is what it, or what it says. I'm not sure. I don't actually, I didn't actually know Cash's last name. There's a pretty big booklet here, uh, for the cover of the album, of course. Uh, I believe both CDs that I've opened so far shows the uh, song credits of all of these uh, are in this booklet, which is pretty cool and looks like the same here. I like the images on this one. So, of course, To My Grave, I'm Ready, Taking Chances. Taking Chances is one of my favorite songs from this project. Uh, Tap, also one of my favorite uh, tracks from this project. Tension, Price on My Head featuring The Weeknd. Uh, Rallo and Tussin featuring Young Thug. I really like that uh, image. Snap is a top 10 nav song for me. Uh, Hold Your Breath featuring Gunna, Why You Crying Mama. Uh, Time Peace featuring Lil Durk, Dior Runners, and Vicodin. Dior Runners, one of my favorite songs. Uh, I really like Vicodin as well. Uh, it's Taylor's favorite nav song, so we used to listen to that a lot. Uh, Stuck With Me, Know Me, and then Amazing featuring Future, one of my favorite nav songs, probably in my top 10. Um, uh, Habits, again, probably close to my top 10 nav songs. Of course, uh, Uzi was supposed to be on that song, but then that was when Uzi was like under arrest with his label, so he wasn't able to let, uh, or his verse wasn't able to get through, so Nav performed his verse uh, on that song. Rack of My Sleep featuring 88 Glam, Go to Hell, a top 10 nav song for me. 
uh, 8 to a 4. Um, another top 10 Nav song for me, Never Know. Uh, okay, featuring Lil Durk and Athlete. So that's a very cool book, but I really like that. But man, this CD is so sick. I love the black and green, like paint splatter kind of look to it. That is very, very cool. Let me put this booklet back in. Oh, first try, nice. So let's take this out. Uh, just a simple black uh, portrait, I guess, on the back of the the CD. But I really, really love this CD. This is probably my favorite CD. This is very, very cool. Uh, similar to Reckless, it's actually a bit translucent, uh, which is pretty cool. Uh, I think it was Reckless, yeah. Nonetheless, very, very cool. I love that colorway. It's really sweet. And it actually has it on the back as well, which is pretty cool. And uh, you guys might be able to tell that it's slightly see-through, uh, which is pretty cool, especially uh, around the Bad Habits or the writing on here. So Bad Habits by Nav, XO, and Republic Records. So very, very cool. Again, this is definitely uh, not my favorite Nav album, but it's got some of my favorite songs from it. Uh, really, this album was uh, the first Nav album that I only took a couple songs out of instead of the majority of the project. The only songs I really revisit here are Tap, uh, Snap, uh, Why You Crying Mama, Dior Runners, uh, Vicodin, Amazing, Habits, Go To Hell, and 8 To 4. Uh, so, yeah, uh, nonetheless, still a really, really good uh, project that I really enjoy. I really want to revisit all of Nav's discography sometime soon uh, before the end of this year. So uh, I'll be excited to listen to it again. Maybe uh, maybe it's changed for me. Maybe I enjoy this album way more than I did back in the day. So thank you guys all so much for watching. Hopefully you did enjoy and I'll see you guys in the next one. Let me know your thoughts on the projects or on the project. Sorry. And bye-bye. Uh,